So on here on channel one, I put up on the second channel, and this is where the video is gonna go tomorrow. Part two and then part three, I'm gonna put on a different platform because we're gonna get into some medical terminology that I know I can't put up here on scum to about that 144,000. Now, I will say this, I didn't get a chance to say on the cookie dough or the backup channel about this 144. The word of God is alive and living. It means different things at certain points, certain time periods. 10 years ago, we wouldn't be here on a different understanding that we have now based on the contamination that has defiled over half of the globe's population. One word that sticks out to me about that 144,000 is defile. They have not defiled themselves with the woman or the harlot. Revelation 17 shows that there is a harlot. She's sitting on top of the beast and that harlot contaminated the world. And so if we think about the word meaning different things at different points, that's because that's very true. Because we would not have had this understanding that I've come to, I'm gonna show you on video, both backed up by the word and medically. And some of you guys are not on the second channel, but you're on the first. Uh, and I will give you a little tidbit. 144,000 is what your, Hold on, truck coming. A hundred and forty-four thousand is what you're made up of. Your DNA structure is a hundred and forty-four thousand strands of DNA, which can be activated. Some of the reports I found kind of mimic the scripture. 12 are active at any given time. 12,000 of the 12 tribes of Judah were selected in Revelation 7. We see them, and then later on in Revelation 7, they have the seal of God in them, and they're preaching the word of God. These are the Jews. They come from the tribes of Judah. Revelation chapter 7 shows the tribes of Judah and the Gentiles standing before the throne in Revelation chapter 7. And then these 12, and then these 144,000, the Bible calls them virgin young men who have not contaminated themselves or defiled themselves with the woman. Doesn't mean sexually. That's the misconception. Now, reason why I say that is because we know we're in a, we're in a time period right now that we wouldn't have understood this based on all the events that have led up to today. Because God has already been to the front and the back we're somewhere in the middle. And when he wrote these verses, they are a mystery unto us because we have not been to the front, middle, and the back yet. We're still traveling through. And the longer we keep living and the longer we keep seeing things unfold, the more certain scriptures start making more sense. Your human body, our human body, is made up of 144,000 in the form of a cruciform shaped like a cross that's God's DNA and so if we're living in the times as it was in the days of Noah where the nephews and the fallen folks their whole goal was to it was to contaminate the whole earth to where it it was defiling God's creation so he had to destroy it all here we are again that 144,000 caused a whole religious movement to be based called the Jehovah's Witness but based on the time that that was conceived we wasn't here where we are now folks this has all been about contaminating God's creation contaminating the DNA the very Dana that makes us up which is cruciform which is a cross God signature there is medical proof that when they introduce certain things in your Dana it changes your cruciform right on their own governmental medical websites. I'm going to show that. I'm going to show it. Part three is going to show that. Part two, we're just going to get into the word and compare some things 
But part three, I'm gonna put on a different platform because I can't say certain things because they'll nuke the entire channel. No warning, no nothing. And that's the other thing. If it wasn't such a bad thing, if it wasn't such so diabolical, why are they blocking everybody and blocking the truth and being told? So in essence, in Adam and Eve, 72,000 chromes in the man, 72,000 chromes in the woman, you put those together, it's 144,000. Those are God's people. People who have that 144 marker in them. When they introduce this garbage to the planet, to the globe, they are adding another strand, which then defiles your garment. We already know what he said, Mr. Gates said in 2005. He told the CI of the A that he created something that destroys the God gene. Okay? It destroys the God gene. We are the 144 of the Gentiles. We all know that the Most High came down on Mount Sion and married Israel. Therefore, begetting Jacob, his first son, which he loved. Out of Jacob came the 12 tribes of Judah. But when they kept screwing up, screwing up, messing up, messing up, he had to have his only begotten son of, okay, of a virgin. Notice, virgin is carried back into the 12, the 144,000, meaning that the 12,000 uh, uh, of 12 tribes, these are the people who have not taken the goof juice. They have not defiled themselves. His first love. We all have 144,000 in us. It's your natural makeup. So I'm going to get into tomorrow on the other channel, but I'll post, I'll backlink it here on this channel in the community. And the whole purpose of all of this, folks, the whole purpose is so that he can contaminate God's creation. Why else would this thing, and they lie about it, oh, it doesn't change your Dana. But it does. <laughs> That's the whole point. And I'm going to prove it to you on their own medical websites. 2013, the highest court in the land made it profitable for the great merchants of the earth. Okay? Because the harlot used her sorcery to perform this pharmacia on the whole world, which is also spoke about in Revelation. Okay? All the 144,000 do of the, of, of the 12 tribes of Jacob, of the Jews, it's just witness and preach the reason why they're chosen is because they've always been the apple of God's eye but if you go back to Revelation chapter 7 you see those Messianic Jews which believe in Christ and did not defile themselves along with it with the Bible says a number that could not be numbered that's us the Gentile the Gentile and the Jew God's fingerprint the cruciform contains 144 thousand strands of which 12 are active <laughs> but in the word of god it said twelve thousand. and number 12 is mentioned which make up the hundred and forty four thousand but scientifically 12 are active in your body and ain't, ain't god something else i've always said it's all about numbers and code and if you can figure out what the code is you can figure out what a lot of stuff is in the bible plain and simple it's all coded okay it's all coded and it's all a plan of the most evil diabolical creation which is that fallen angel he knows this so i want to defile as many of his people as i can it breaks the the, the barrier here it contaminates your whole entire inners it can never come out and the more you take, the worse off you are. What Jesus say? You were worse off with the one before the seven came back. Okay? Worse off. Already knew Jeremiah 1 and 5. We the ones that don't know. But the more we move in time and the more we see these things coming to pass, the more you start saying, oh, now that scripture makes sense. Because I didn't see that. God already saw it. But now we see it. It's all been about what? The DNA. That's what this whole thing about getting people to take this vaccination 
It's about contaminating the Dana so that you are unredeemable not unless you repent. Now, I can't judge because a lot of people have repented, but this is all about contamination. Now, why you think they're coming after the babies at six months years old? They don't even have an immune, but yet they're going after them. Don't that, come on now. So stay out on the lookout tomorrow. I'm gonna be popping that video up on the second channel, but I will backlink it. And then I'm going to go on a third platform and show you the medical proof of what I'm talking about and line it up with the scripture. Because I can't say the names and things. I can't show you that because they will definitely kibosh both channels. But I'm going to give you a different understanding what the 144 mean. Not what everybody else is telling you. But I'm going to give you a whole different meaning of it. And it makes sense more than ever now that we're in this time and in this hour. Deuces.